How would you like to learn an incredible, easy method for reprogramming your subconscious mind? Hi there everyone, Robert Zink, Miracle Mentor and Alchemy Life Coach. And we are absolutely excited to be bringing you this daily video to empower your life. And today we are soaring high like a big, beautiful eagle flying in the direction of your dreams and your goals. And that's what this channel is all about, your dreams and your goals. Speaking of dreams, your subconscious mind, your subconscious mind is the most powerful tool in the entire universe. I'm not exaggerating. Your subconscious mind is the most powerful tool in the entire universe. Look, your subconscious mind has the ability to stop you from getting what you desire because it's filled with doubts and fears and anxiety and limiting beliefs. Or your subconscious mind has the ability to act as a huge universal magnet, pulling in God force energy and helping you manifest anything you desire. The choice is yours. Your nighttime routine is the most critical for reprogramming your subconscious mind. Neville Goddard. Look, any time of the day is important and a good time to reprogram your subconscious mind. But as Neville said, the nighttime is the most essential. It's the most important. So, and oftentimes we're tired. We just want to fall asleep. We've had a rough day. We want to start over tomorrow. The problem is, is a lot of the stuff that was in yesterday gets carried over to the next day. When you learn to reprogram your subconscious mind, you're going to make a huge difference in tomorrow's thoughts and tomorrow's outcomes. Look, this is the most essential statement I can make. What you think about in your subconscious mind tonight is what you will begin manifesting tomorrow. Oh, I said it. Did you hear that? What you think about in your subconscious mind tonight is what you will begin manifesting tomorrow. Now here's the problem. The problem is, is that you have no control of what is going on in your subconscious mind. Once you fall asleep, once you are into the deeper sleep states, then it's very, very difficult, if not impossible to control what is taking place in your subconscious mind. So your subconscious may be reinforcing limiting beliefs and doubts and fears. But here's the secret. The secret is this understanding that you go through four different states, four different levels of brain waves. They are the beta state, which is wide awake, the alpha state, which is meditation. This is when you are falling asleep. This is relaxation. Many artists and athletes and musicians love the alpha state because it's where they do their best creative work. Next, there's the theta state. This is a dreamlike state, and this is where the action really begins in the theta state. This is the magical state. I call it the magical state of manifesting your deepest desires. And finally, we have the delta state. This is where you're sound asleep. Everything is going very, very slow. And this is the state where you can do deep, deep inner mind programming, or shall we say reprogramming. So the secret is to send a flare deep into your subconscious mind 
a flare of new beliefs because old beliefs don't work. Old beliefs have gotten you what you've gotten so far. And if you're not satisfied with what you've received, then you're not attracting to your maximum potential. So as you are falling asleep at night, as you're just dozing off, you want to be programming your subconscious mind. So how do we do that? Well, the first thing I like to do is put my hands in a very unusual position. These four fingers on each hand represent the four elements or the four directions in space. The thumb represents spirit. So as I put my hands in this position and I begin to visualize, but it's, oh no, 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 no. It's not good enough to visualize. You've got to emotionalize. So I don't just look at the new Harley Davidson. I actually step on the motorcycle and put my hands on it and feel the leather under my seat and start the engine and feel the nice purr of the engine. And then I drive it and I'm fully and completely engaged. In other words, I'm not watching it on a screen. I'm totally and completely engaged. Now, why am I doing this with my hands? Because by doing this with your hands for a few weeks, after a few weeks, when you hop into bed and you put your hands in this position to fall asleep in, guess what will happen? You'll immediately go into that state. You'll immediately sink into those deeper states of consciousness faster. And that means more power and implanting more reprogramming into your subconscious mind. Now take one thing, one thing that you desire and look at all of the negative or limiting beliefs that you have. I'm too old. It's never going to work for me. I don't know where I'd get the money. She's dating someone else now. You know, I'm not healthy enough. I never learned that in school. It's too late to learn it now. I mean, the limiting beliefs go on and on. I don't know what your limiting beliefs are, but take your limiting beliefs and challenge them. Challenge them head on as you are falling asleep. In other words, fall in love with that experience. And as that limiting belief or that negative thought comes into your mind, challenge it. Say, no way you don't exist. You have no power here. Here in this realm, I have the power. And the power is I have an incredible loving relationship. I'm happier than ever before. You notice I'm making it present tense. I own a beautiful new Harley Davidson motorcycle. I am taking the vacation of a lifetime. I'm traveling around the world. I have a new career and I'm excited about it. I mean, I'm doing wonderful things in my career and they absolutely love me. Challenge those limiting beliefs by overemphasizing how good you're going to feel, how good you do feel, how good it does feel right now and fall asleep with that good feeling. Oh yeah. I love falling asleep with that good feeling. Sometimes it can simply be counting money, brand new $100 bills. Sometimes it might be sitting in a canoe with the person you love doing something you've never done before, but you're doing it now. And of course your hands are in this position. Now you don't have to do the hand thing, but trust me, it works. It really does. I mean, there are times throughout the day when I feel challenged. We all do, right? All I do is do this for like, oh, I don't know, 30 seconds, a minute. And I am transformed right back into that resourceful manifesting beast living within me. Okay. I mean, I just feel great. All the good feelings that I've been reprogramming my mind with all the new thoughts and experiences 
are right here, right here. So you can bring on those experiences throughout the day. It's a wonderful way of empowering yourself and taking your nighttime reprogramming dream experience into the daytime as well. You must be in the consciousness of being or having that which you want to be or to have before you drop off to sleep. Once asleep, you will have no freedom of choice. Your entire slumber is dominated by your last waking concept of self. Neville Goddard from feeling is the secret. Isn't that wonderful feeling? I don't just visualize it. It isn't, um, what's the word I'm looking for routine. In other words, it's a new experience every night. It's, it's a, the same experience, but it's a new experience. It's like riding a new motorcycle every day. It's the same motorcycle, but you're going a different place, a different direction. You make it new, a new movie every night as you fall asleep and you emotionalize it. You feel that passion, that love. And as you, as you allow those thoughts to permeate your subconscious mind, as you fall asleep, your subconscious will take it and do the rest. You'll be reprogramming your subconscious mind to manifest the life that you truly desire. And I'm excited for you. You are soaring high like a big, beautiful Eagle. Thank you so much. Thanks for subscribing. You have a great day because you absolutely deserve it. Bye-bye now.